So ovarian cancer is one of the most lethal gynecological cancers in the Western world. In the US alone, 22,000 women are diagnosed every year. And it is estimated that more than 70% of ovarian cancer patients will die within five years. The classical view of cancer was more like attacking the tumor cell by itself using just chemotherapy or surgery. But now people realize that the immune system plays a fundamental role in tumor progression. For the last 20 years, we've been working on a cellular process called the endoplasmic reticulum stress response. And this is a molecular pathway that cells utilize to ensure survival and adaptation when there's stressful conditions, like for example, low oxygen concentration or nutrient deprivation. So these happens uh, in normal physiological processes, but the problem is that tumors have actually exploited this molecular pathway to actually ensure survival in the tumor microenvironment. My research is focused on understanding how these immune cells of the tumor microenvironment either control or promote ovarian cancer. So what we have seen is that if you um, knock out or knock down this pathway, the ER stress response in T cells and dendritic cells of the tumor microenvironment, tumor progression is actually inhibited. We're using nanoparticles to stimulate dendritic cells at the tumor site. And we're also engineering a novel type of anti-tumor T cells that hopefully in the future, when we move into the clinic, could actually bring some hope for ovarian cancer patients. My driving force is always trying to translate what we find in the lab to the clinic into a cure. The Cancer Research Institute has been also very important for that purpose because you have many opportunities for networking with clinicians and try to actually move your basic findings into the clinic. Over the last five years, when uh, we first started publishing our papers on targeting the immune response as a new therapy for ovarian cancer in preclinical models, we usually get many, many emails from patients who are absolutely uh, devastated by the disease and they're actually looking for some hope. Well, what I would like them to understand, you know, all the supporters and the patients, is that there's a cure within you, you know, which is the immune system. The, your immune system can be reprogrammed to fight cancer and we can actually harness that activity, that function that is within all of us to fight cancer and to also prevent cancer.